Since everybody is different, it can be difficult to make a general statement about just how much food is too much. It's important to note that just because someone might be larger than average doesn't mean they are unhealthy. So let's start by breaking it down and seeing what happens when we get too much of certain nutrition and minerals. Sugar. It makes things taste so sweet, but unfortunately, it seems to negatively impact our health and consume in increasing qualities. One recent study found a significant relationship between added sugar consumption and increased risk of dying from cardiovascular disease. Weight of absorbing participants for over 14 years. What makes this study so important is that re researcher took into account how healthy the participants' diet were other than just sugar instead scoring them using something or the healthy eating index which is used by the USDA regardless of how the participants scored more sugar was still was associated with higher cardiovascular mortality other studies have also linked certain sugar in sticks to things like obesity, type 2 diabetes, and high blood pressure. Salt. It seems that everything has a bunch of it nowadays, while it's important to get some sodium in our diet. Research suggests that too much of it contributes to things like high blood pressure, stroke, stomach cancer, and even osteoporosis. The American Heart Association recommends no more than 2,300 milligrams of sodium a day, and ideally only around 1,500 milligrams fat. While there is some debate in the nutritional world on if certain fats are healthy or not. One type of fat is typically agreed upon to be unhealthy, trans fats. The general consensus is that trans fats increase the level of LDL, the cholesterol in blood, consequently increasing our risk of things like coronary heart disease. But one recent study even found that higher trans fat intake is associated with increased risk of mortality. More research on that would be great because right now it seems like almost any amount of trans fats is too much. But long term effects of the overrating aside, could you really eat so much in one sitting that you die? While there don't really seem to be any studies on this, thankfully, so there have been cases where overeating is thought to be the causes of people's death. In the instances, the pe person's overeating was thought to have lead to their stomach rupturing or caused them to choke on the food which was cause of their death. The frequencies of cases like this seems to be very rare though, so I probably won't worry about it. The next time you hit up a buffet or visit your grandparents' house, they always have too much food. 